Ah, another beautiful day to wreck some equipment. <laughs> hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the construction series. We are here in Mills County, and we have gone to dig up a pool here today. That's what we're doing, at least. So we got to take this trailer on over to pick up our excavator so we can take, run over here and dig this pool. Now, the pool we're building is actually just down the road right here. We're actually going to pass it along our way. It'll be up here to our left, I do believe. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you get a big old thumbs up. If you find yourself watching more than one video, then it's a good sign that you enjoy the content and you want to be notified when new videos are posted. So click that subscribe button to join the Pickle Jar community. And before you say anything, yes. My voice sounds a little weird. I'm hoarse. My voice is kind of gone. It is getting better. Well, that's interesting. I just got a call from the guy who wanted us to dig out an area for his pool. And uh, he just asked if we... Oh, hey, what's up, Frank the Cat? And he just asked if we could uh, delay that until a later date. So I did a little calling around and uh, we are going to change some things on our schedule. We are... Uh, now we are going to bury a pipe for someone who uh, we were going to do tomorrow, but we will get that done today. So a little bit of change of plans that tends to happen sometimes here in the construction world, but we will do whatever we can. So we are going to bury some pipe instead. Oh, snap. Wait, crackle and pop, by the way. Uh, we need to turn around again. All right, we are... Pulling into the job site that has been going on for months and has made, like, no progress whatsoever at all. Uh, it is the place where we we're building a truck stop. <laughs> yep. It's still on hold. Uh, so the... Okay, don't mind me just driving through your corn real quick, bud. So the problem is the state, uh, they pulled our permit to build. So we've just kind of been at a standstill here and haven't made any more progress. Something came up that the state didn't like, and we filed something wrong, or I don't know. Something happened, and they told us we can't continue building until it gets taken care of. So we've been just stopped on this job site now for the last, oh gosh, few months. It's been ridiculous. So we've got already got, a, like, a load of dirt in here, and I'm not going to complain. Um, we'll just keep that dirt in there while we drive, or while we load this up, and... Hopefully we don't spill it all, I guess. <laughs> it's about time I pick this thing up anyways. Don't you agree, Frank? I mean, we've been kind of putting that off for a little while now. All right, we're all hooked up. Let's roll on out of here. We could get that excavator and stuff out of here as well, but those will be fine. Not the most pressing matter at hand. Most pressing matter is jackknifing the semi, yes. The most pressing matter is getting to work on these pipes. So what we're gonna do is take this wheel loader back to the construction yard, unload it, we're gonna dump this dirt into a dump truck, fill up the dump truck completely with dirt, take that dump truck over to the job site, dump it into the hole in the ground as I drive through more corn from this dude's field. And then repeat process. Pretty simple stuff. What about Casey's, Frank? Do you want Casey's? Oh my gosh. You don't even want Casey's? What's wrong with you? This is not... Frank is sick. Frank has got to be feeling sick. There's something wrong with you. I don't know. Don't know what the deal is, Cat, but you need to get yourself figured out. All right. We are showing up at the construction... Or the... The, the construction yard. The job yard. The, the our, our base. I don't know what to... Look, words are hard. And speaking is very difficult right now. It hurts my throat to talk. So bear with me. <laughs> we are going to whip on in here. And uh, that is missing a bucket. Or it's got the forks on it. Where's the bucket for it? Hello? Oh, there's a bucket. Okay. So, yeah. We're going to just drop this off right over here, I think. Pull it off the trailer nice and easy. Lemons. Oh, geez. That was not nice and easy at all, was it? Just got to whip this thing on over here. Yeah, that's actually going to be in the... Well, well, I don't need to dump this in there, so that's all right. I'm missing something. Oh, it was the wheel loader. Doi. Now, I mean, I guess I... Yeah, no, actually, I do need to. Let's fire up this wheel loader. In case you're wondering why we have two wheel loaders, one is for the yard. 
to load up and one is for job sites and so we don't have to split between the two of them we've got gravel in this pit and i don't think we'll need any gravel here today but actually we may take a load of gravel just for base layer drainage hmm yeah i think we will take a load of gravel okay then can we yeah we should be able to we should be able to sneak by that i think we'll be all right let's get this hooked up there we go back on up we'll put a load of gravel in this wheel loader and we'll use both wheel loaders oh actually i can't put gravel and rock in one uh we'll take a load of gravel first it'll be all right we'll make it work we're figuring things out as we go along so let's pick this up there we go got a bucket full of gravel back her up turn on the wishy wash lights because i forgot to turn those suckers on oh my gosh these things are loud dude okay and pull it forward just a little bit right there we'll do stop i'm gonna go over here and shut this one down because i don't need it running at the moment okay we got that shut down and now we just need to get a dump truck right over here did we take one of these or one of these probably one that uh i think these ones are actually yeah the freight liners have a higher weight capacity so we'll take the freight liner let's fire it up back it on up that's forwards back it on up there we go so we're gonna take a ride on over here get it filled up with a load of gravel not a full load just one bucket should be enough for us i would i would think we may need more than one bucket we will find out um i also may need some dudes with shovels down there digging some of that stuff up but we'll see what happens let's just pull that right on forward like so right about there should do perfect hop out get up in the wheel loader pick it up nice and easy continue going up there you go there you go up 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 and now let's just pull forward and dump that right on in perfect so I'm going to fill this up with gravel, and then we will take this load of gravel over to the uh, the job site today. All right, set that down, shut it all off, hop back up in the dump truck, and let's roll. This also, uh, does this thing have a tarp on it? I believe it does. All right, we will be taking a left right up here. Let's turn on the blinker. There we go. Blinker's running. And hit the brakes. Ooh, this thing actually has great brakes. I was not expecting that. Not going to lie to you. Right up here. It looks like y'all need to mow your yard. You want me to mow that for you? I'll do it if you pay me. Right there it is. This is the one we're working on. Four ways on. And let's see. Looks like we got a good spot to back up right here. So let's just turn her on around. Okay, there we'll do. Ooh, ho, 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 ho. Bad, bad truck. You're going to get me stuck now, boy. This is back right on up here. This is going to take more than one load of grapple, isn't it? Oh, boy. Well, we'll see what happens. This is not a good place for me to try and dump right here, is it? Maybe I should just dump it on... Maybe I should just dump it and then use the wheel loader to spread it? Do I dump it near or do I dump it in? Decisions? Decisions, man. I don't like that spot for dumping, so we're going to try and find a new one here. This is not going to go well. Let's just dump it right here. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Let's get the rear wheels almost hanging off there. Or literally hanging off. Perfect. Yep. We got both rear wheels hanging off. Can't, probably shouldn't go back any further. We actually might, we might, uh, we might fall back into the pit when I unload this. I guess let's see what happens, shall we? All right, let's unload. There it goes. Oh, yeah, it's piling it up right in the corner. That is exactly what I needed that to do. Lovely. Actually, that filled up that area there pretty darn well, though, didn't it? Hmm. I don't want the whole thing with gravel, though, so this is a problem. Okay. I just wanted, like, a base layer of gravel. Oh, boy. Maybe I shouldn't have done gravel. This is going to complicate things. That's all right. Let's go and get another load of gravel, shall we? I guess we better get a full load of gravel, not just a bucket. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, a bucket will do. Yeah, Jake, a bucket will fill the corner. All right, and just pull the truck up right here. That should do. Hop out, hop in to the wheel loader. If 
powered up, turn on the wishy wash lights, pick up the bucket, and get some more gravel. You guys get the ordeal. We just continue the hold on. Wait a minute. It's a little dark. Turn on them lights. Oh, yes, that did absolutely nothing. Lovely. And let's pick up a little bit of that gravel. There we go. Should be about a full bucket. Back on up. Hopefully, no one's back behind me here. Doesn't look like it. Very good. I've never actually had to fill up fuel on any of these pieces of equipment, so that's interesting. Now that I think about it. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. And right there will do. Dump it. Perfect. Dumping in the first bucket. Lovely. Now let's repeat that for the rest until she's full. All right, it is full. We got a full bucket. Let's get on over back to the job site. And we're coming up to the turn once again. So slow down. Take the turn. Good thing no one was coming. Wasn't really watching. We'll pull right on up here. Dump out the gravel. And uh, I think this... I think now this should be enough just for a base layer for a little bit of drainage um and then we will go and fill up with a bunch a bunch of dirt and we will get this pipe completely covered let's let's see where do we want to be out here let's uh let's just line up here again this ought to do we'll back all the way up like we did last time there we go put the two wheels over the edge oh whoa 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 she almost <laughs> We almost went too far there. Perfect. Now, let's dump this gravel. All right. Well, I guess we'll, uh, I'm going to take a couple shovels and start shoveling this that way. Whew. Oh, man. Oh, man. That took a while. I called a couple of the boys and I was like, look, you're going to have to come out here and help me. We need a lot of loads of dirt. I'm not going to walk on that yet because I don't know if it's fully stable. It, you know, the ground needs to settle. But it looks like we got that pipe completely buried now. It's up to the homeowner to plant the grass here that is missing. But that is their problem. We got the pipe completely buried. That is another job well done for our construction company. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up. If you find yourself watching more than one video, then it's a good sign you enjoy the content. You want to be notified when new videos are posted. So click that subscribe button to join the Pickle Jar community. Over 75% of you guys are not subscribed, so if you could help me out by clicking that subscribe button. Austin is 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 gaining on me. I've always had a 10,000 uh, person gap, and now it's less than five or 6,000. So uh, help a pickle out and click that subscribe button. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. And until next time, I'll see you all later.